welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to do a um, like a length check for you guys because the last time I did a length check where my hair was actually straight and my hair has grown since then. So I think that it's appropriate time for me to do a length check. Um, to be honest, my routine has been real boring but I'm still gonna share it with you guys. A lot of times when we are experiencing hair growth, it happens when you don't pay attention or when you're just going on about your life and then bam, your hair is growing because you're not worried about it and you're just kind of taking care of it. So I feel like that's what happened with me. Um, so I wanted to show you guys my length today. Right now my hair is brushed, brushed out, all my curls are combed out and I just twist it. Um, I literally just put it into two twists and that was it. So first thing I wanted to mention about my recent hair growth is that I haven't been doing much to my hair. When you kind of leave your hair alone, it actually grows because you're not putting a lot of pressure on it and you're not like doing the most to it and you're just keeping your routine very simple and a lot of time that does yield growth so lately I have been washing my hair I have been shampooing I only co-wash co a little bit I don't co-wash as much as I used to which has helped my hair a lot and also um, I've noticed that my hair reacts very well to my deep, my uh, conditioner, my strengthening conditioner has really helped my hair. I'm not even kidding you. So the conditioner that I'm talking about is by Norwich Prashante on my website. I started using that conditioner as a leave-in. I originally had it formulated to be like a all-around conditioner, but I noticed for my hair it works best as a leave-in. So I've been using it as a leave-in conditioner and it's that light to where it can be that, but it also is packed with nutrients. It's a very simple conditioner. Um, I do want to eventually add a little bit more to it so it can be even more impactful, but it has been working on my hair like crazy. My hair has been um, moisturized. My hair has been very soft. My hair has been very soft. And, wow. And my hair has been just easy to manage. And I use it on my hair, I use it on my daughter's hair, and our hair, her hair um, needs a little bit more of it, but it reacts the same on both of our hair. And it's gonna be available on my site very soon. Of course, I'm gonna update you guys when it's available. Right now, it is sold out. Um, but yeah, that conditioner has been really working with my hair as far as keeping it moisturized. And that was my goal for my products. Like, I want my products to moisturize your hair. And that's what's always worked for my hair, so that's why I wanted that to be within a product. And that's what it does. It like it moisturizes your hair, and if your hair is moisturized, it normally leads to hair growth. So that's the first thing I've been doing. I have uh, been using a leave-in, and then putting a gel on, and then sealing my hair with an oil. Uh, my routine changed a little bit. It does change a little bit in the summertime, so my hair routine does kind of like. Some things fall off. I don't do certain things in the summertime. So if you guys want to see that in the video, um, go ahead and let me know down in the comment section. One other thing that I've been doing is I have been um, twisting my hair, or I'll be I'll put it in a wash and go, and then for like two days I will leave my hair alone. So if my hair is in the twist, I'll leave my hair in the twist for like um, a day or two and then I'll take it out and my hair will just be like this, like it is right now. Um, this is a two twist out. <laughs> so I twist my hair into twists and took it out. And um, also when I do my wash and goes, I do my wash and goes, goes on that first day. I do everything on that first day and then by the third day I'll refresh it again but basically throughout the week, I'm not like doing anything crazy. And it may be because I have not been having a lot of time for my hair and to, and honestly, I've been a lot busier and working on a lot of other stuff, behind the scenes stuff. So I just haven't been like that into hair. If you've been following me on my channel for a while, you know that I'm pretty much simple in my hair anyways. So I don't do a lot.
when I trim my hair all the time, it doesn't grow. And I think that's for everyone. So for me, I feel like that getting your ends trimmed like more spaced out is better. Maybe some people don't think that, but that's just my conclusion. Because I feel like that if you cut your hair all the time, then how are you gonna ever get it to grow? Like you keep cutting it. And when it comes to deep conditioners, um, I still am doing my same thing, which is either using my DIYs or using my Nourish by Chante, um Rich Deep Deep Treatment Mask, or I'll just use Shea Moisture's Deep Treatments, which are absolutely amazing. I love Shea, Mo Shea Moisture's Deep Conditioners. But I just like to keep that in my routine. Um, it really does help my hair be a lot more manageable and it helps it to um, retain its length rather than just getting the length there. It actually helps for it to stay. And also, sealing my hair with an oil. Um, you guys already know, you know what I'm gonna say. I've been using my growth oil, my um, stimulating growth oil, which is available on my website. Um, I'll have a link down in my description box. You can see all the reviews from where people actually do get growth. Um, that is a very amazing oil, and that's what I use to seal my hair. Sometimes I'll use um, jojoba oil, sometimes I'll use um, no, those are, those are mainly the two that I recommend. So jojoba oil and I'll use my growth oil to seal my hair. And to me, oils really do make your hair grow. So I want you guys to keep in mind that detangling your hair when you are doing your detangling routine is very important for your hair growth as well because you don't want to be like pulling your hair and pulling out your hair and causing your hair to have a lot of breakage. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick length check on my hair for you guys and to see how much it's grown. like an updated routine let me know um, and also a lot of you have been asking me to do an update on Araya's wash and go um, so I will be posting that video but Naraya is not the easiest to get on camera so if you guys want to see Naraya get on camera <laughs> like this video to let me know and I'm gonna need a lot of likes <laughs> so guys let me know down in the comment section if you want to see my summer routine of course and also what have you been doing for your hair growth has it been like a super simple routine or is it like a more complex routine? Um, what works best for you? Like I said, simple works best for my hair. My hair responds better to like more natural ingredients and simple routines. Um, so, but some people have like a jam packed growth routine and maybe that works for some people. I think this was all I have for this video. Um, so let me know what you guys think. Um, yeah, and I'll see you guys in my next one. I don't think I have anything else to say. See you later.